One of our findings are in the paper, which I think is a, a very positive finding, is that self-custodied holders have a lot more influence than those really big collective entities because they can generally act faster. And especially in, in a hard fork scenario where investors do have a significant amount of power, acting quickly is very impactful. It's very hard to, to come back from behind. And so if there's a hard fork that occurs, people that are self custody their own coins can literally act you know, within the hour, within the day. They, whereas the larger and more complex of an entity that you are, you're gonna have to go through more checks before taking any action on that given hard fork. If you're just self-custodying, you just on the spot can make that call and the only consequences are for you. And so you can act quickly and more decisively. And I think that's that's one of the positive findings from our paper is that that's actually um, a rather, I'd say, anti-fragile aspects of the network. That some of the most committed uh, and smaller entities actually have kind of a, a disproportionate impact compared to some of those larger entities.